snow, but some people love it. Garrick Hake found one block of Raytown that was happy. Today on Blue Ridge Boulevard, there's no business like snow business. At Raytown Lawnmower, Lewis Mattoon makes green when the town turns white by selling and fixing snowblowers. They always say, if Raytown don't have it, you're not going to get it. This afternoon, he helped one happy customer after another. He had what I needed, thank God. <laughs> he, had, I had, he had the parts that I needed on this. A banner day for the 45-year-old business that has struggled at times in the recent drought. This morning, we had people waiting for us when we got here at 8 o'clock. Today, we have virtually sold out of all the snow, new snowblowers, and we've got a few used ones left. Of course, the snowblower is not for everybody. Some folks prefer to clear out their drive the old-fashioned way, but of course, if you're not doing it right, you might go from there to over here. Chiropractor Charles Chira didn't see much snow growing up in Nigeria, but he knew if he opened his practice today, he'd see plenty of patients. Doc, what's the number one thing people are calling you asking about today? Today is back pain, and I know it's from shoveling the snow. This afternoon, dispensing shoveling advice along with his services. Just have to use your knee. When you bend down, you have to use your knee. <laughs> Across the street at Panetti's Coffee, the labor was less intense, steaming lattes and pouring cups of joe for those wary of another day in the snow. Why would you keep holding yourself hostage just because there's snow? Not an option. Not needs not for me. Getting back to business as usual, one block at a time. In Raytown, Garrett Hake, 41 Action News.